Good afternoon. It is uh, 2.30. I have had my breakfast. I have watched some YouTube. Um, so I am feeling productive thus far. It's pretty cloudy, but pretty nice outside. Kind of calm. 70-some degrees. Um, need to run to the bank again. I feel like I'm there every day, but when neighbors keep coming over, oh, we're sorry we missed you when you mowed, and then they hand me cash, I cash to me is worthless because I'm not going to go to a restaurant and pay... 17 16 for a meal and then get all these quarters and I hate having a little change like that so I'm gonna go liquidate that into a checking account where I don't have to get quarters when I leave or pennies or nickels or dimes all right so I just went over to Lowe's and got uh, something from my dad and family to my grandmother for Mother's Day Sunday uh, it's 3.10. I picked a horrible time to go downtown and get gas. Uh, this part of the afternoon, the school's just let out. Everybody's driving home. There are buses. There are people. The school zone, 20 mile an hour things. Oh, I'm kind of regretting that now. But it's supposed to rain soon, and I would like to do this before it rains, because Friday is my my fill-up day. Anyways, uh, when I was coming home from Lowe's, I looked down to see what the temperature was, and it said 23.5. And for a minute I thought, oh, why is there a decimal point? And then I thought, why is it 23? That's not right. The windows are down. I'm in shorts and it's nice. Then I looked and that little F had turned to a C. For those of you who don't know what I mean, I'm talking Fahrenheit to Celsius. Um, so why did my temperature switch to Celsius? There's a setting in the menu for that somewhere. Then I looked at the odometer, 238,000. Like, wow, somebody go out for a drive last night, like a freaking 60, 70,000 mile drive? Well, no. That was in kilometers. Why is all my shit going euro on me? I have 282,000 kilo kilometers, degrees Celsius. This stuff down here was also 23.5. I don't get it. Um, a key cycle, pulling the key out, putting the key back in, brought it back to... Uh, to, uh, to miles and Fahrenheit. I didn't even have to touch anything in the menu. Uh, I tried to film it, but as soon as I put it in, it, it went back to miles. So if, if that clip worked out, and if you can see the 282 or whatever it was, I'll put that in now. Well, we got a problem with the car. Let's take a look at this. It's just the joy of dealing with the German car. Key goes in. Look at that. Oh, it's back. Yeah, I don't know. Weird. Uh, I was going to try a battery disconnect next and see if there's anything weird like that. Can you guys see the truck behind me? It's a Chevy, whatever they call their pickup truck, Ram 1500, but that's a really old one. Or that's Dodge. I don't know. It has antlers coming out of the front grill. Like, legit antlers. Welcome to Hudson. Or Stowe. Well, I just had to get out and look. And no, it's not a real M5 even though somebody put ridiculously huge quad exhaust on it. It does not have M5 seats, nor the navigation system, nor M5 gauges. So uh, it's it's trying. <laughs> He's got really, really wide rear tires on it. Mine are 275s. I don't think they're that wide. He's got aftermarket wheels. I will film as I drive by it. Without backing into the sky behind me. Oh, I love PDC. And nobody coming. We good, we good, we good. Does not have shadow line trim either. There's those wheels. Not a fan. They're kind of trying to be these OEM uh, style 65 wheels, but uh, they seem to be a little bit bigger and a little bit wider, perhaps, but they're not. There goes an X6. Even in Hudson, there are not a lot of those. Well, it's going to be an E39 day, except that's a Oxford 528. All right, guys, guess what? Guess what? We're at the intersection again, and, uh, and uh, Razvan just pointed out that this is where I always start filming it, but this time it is classier than usual. How does this fit your head? I'm going to rip it. Uh, I'm wearing it now, and he's got the uh, best on back there. I'm actually going to give this back to you. It's not mine. You can use it as a cup. It doesn't fit. Damn straight it does. It is it indeed raining. Rain. It's raining, and has the temperature dropped yet? You got a, you got yourself a thermometer? No. No thermometer? No way. All right, <laughs> hang on. We'll go old school here. It is 72. It's updating. Yep, temperature has dropped. It's going to get very cold over the next few days. 
what is a mole sauce? I don't really know. What do you have to say? It's too big. Too big? Oh, mine's not. You guys see the other M5 over there? I said it was an E39 day earlier, and it is. That's the silver one. That's an 01. You got oh yeah, that's in my dust. I have the license plates on that. This is very strange looking. You guys won't understand what this is right now. And you probably won't anyway because this isn't Ryan's camera. It is my camera. Welcome back guys. It is now very early in the morning. We're back from Brad's. Good music, good time, and I am going to bed. Sorry for a crappy ending. I'll talk to you tomorrow.